What is up? We are here at a restaurant called Mr. George and that person over there, who I'm about to show you, has never had an espresso before. So that is a crime to not have had an espresso in life. So she's going to try an espresso right now in our midst and we are going to see her reaction to espressos. But we bought it to a nice place for the espresso. They make proper espresso, so she's gonna have the real experience. She looks slightly nervous. What is going through your head? Complete and utter terror. <laughs> Fear on every single level. I don't know if I'll ever be the same. I really don't like coffee without milk and now I'm trying espresso which is a lot stronger than coffee. It's about to go down. trying a fabulous dessert. This what is, is what happens, it's called a chocolate jar. This is what happens when you've had espressos and you now can move on to... <laughs> and then there's me. <laughs> Caleb, who needs to try it, and this is her having an espresso for the first time. Okay, it doesn't smell bad. Hopefully, it tastes nice. Cheers, here we go. <laughs> it hits you with a strong ooh, and then it tastes nice at the end. So, your thoughts? Uh, it's nice, it's horrible but nice at the same time. <laughs> it starts off horrible and then it goes nice, leaving a nice aftertaste in your mouth. So it's worth it. Better a drink that leaves I'm a nice still making, aftertaste. I'm still making up my mind. <laughs> not bad. It's not bad. It is not bad. It's not bad. So we just enjoyed a lovely espresso. She likes espresso. Kind of. Getting she there. She wants to have another one. This yes, has been a good day. I do. I want to espresso it up. So what we're about to do is we're taking the sub's mother, Mother Dearest, and Bobby we're going sparkles. to ask her questions. We're going to see who's the preferred child. How well does she know us? Who's better at what? Are you ready, Mother Dearest? I am. You are? Sasha, she are sounds you ready so confident. <laughs> <laughs> question number one. Who is the most attractive? How could you ask our mother that question? Seriously? You can't say both. You have to choose one. I can so say both. I look more like her. Just say. You, you are know. both very, very attractive. <laughs> Possibly too much so. <laughs> dum dum dum. Okay, who has the best singing voice? Kayla. Ah, oh, just had to throw that in there. Okay, <clears throat> who's always had the messiest room? Little girls, Sashi was messy and Kayla was perfectionist, like you could measure everything, perfectionist. <laughs> and now that you're older, Kayla's messy. I am Sashi not messy. Is perfectionist. I am not messy. <laughs> oh, the conspiracy against me today. Who is the friendliest? Kayla. 
extrovert. Oh. She's an extrovert. <laughs> Who is the most humble? Sashley. I think I am very humble. Who is the most talkative sibling? Kayla. Hmm. Which of the siblings got into the most trouble? Kayla. I was abused. She was unnecessarily abused. I got hidings for her. I took some of her hidings. Thank you, Thank you so much, Sashi. Hmm? Taking it for the team. Okay. <laughs> Let's put this to the test. What are our favorite foods? Sashi loves chicken. Sashi likes will anything. will never understand why. Anything but. that's quality. So she won't just eat because she's hungry, but she will eat something that's been nicely put together. She would rather eat quality than quantity and really enjoy what she's eating. Kayla is more a meat girl than a chicken girl, but we all know she loves pizza, Ooh. ice cream. Mm. Yeah. Our mother knows us. Well done, mother. Okay. <laughs> she does feed us. <laughs> yes, she does. She really does. So. <laughs> okay. So next question. Who has the best hair? Kayla. She knows how to style. She's got thicker hair than Sasha Lee and I. We've got finer hair, lots of it, but finer. And it flops quickly. <laughs> Whereas when Kayla Frizzy. does her hair, she a hairdresser, by the way, can't do Kayla's hair as well as Kayla can do her own hair. It lasts like that for days. And Kayla is prepared to sit for two hours and do her hair. We would never. Yeah. <laughs> okay, who has the best sense of style? I would say Sasha Lee has style because there's stuff Kayla and I would look at and Sham, we used to tease Sasha Lee. Like We'd hold it up at a shop and go, Sasha, do you like this? Because it was like terrible and we were literally teasing her but then she would like it and if she, she bought it she'd rock she'd it so it good, she yeah. has got really good style who has the biggest appetite kayla very sad very 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 sad <laughs> we all like food though okay what is your best childhood memory of me and chachi i can remember it raining and there was water on the paving outside and the two of you ran and put your costumes on you were little and you literally i've got photos of you <laughs> pretending you were swimming you're both lying on your bellies oh, in no. this pool of water and you guys <laughs> played for ages swimming in this big swimming pool clearly we were deprived of, of a, a swimming, swimming pool when we were younger <laughs> i can remember the two of you fighting over gavin their dad my husband um as to who was his wife but fighting that they they were arguing and fighting and eventually i said to them evan is my husband which to which they both burst into tears <laughs> that's very um, interesting children and then there was also the time that they were fighting about being cinderella but fighting about who is cinderella and eventually I just turned and said to them, well, actually I'm Cinderella and the two of you are her ugly sisters because they were fighting in a really <laughs> ugly manner. Can you imagine that? And they were so upset with me for saying that. <laughs> so besides that, is there any other hilarious argument that you remember me and her having? I remember Sashi once biting you as a baby because you used to push her and she push her abusive. and push her. And then the one day she took a bite out of you and you stopped pushing her off to I that. think I still have the scar I to stood this up day. for myself. Huh. I still Self have the defense, scar to people. this day. Most aggressive violence. I empowered myself beyond victimhood <laughs> with my teeth. So that has been an interesting Q&A session with our mother dearest. I think she passed. What do you think? I definitely think she passed. I think so too. <laughs> Comment down below. Tell us what you thought. What do you think? How well did you think she did? And don't forget to subscribe to yes. Active TV to like the video. Like it, share it out. And this is the Zips. Have a nice life. Peace.